this morning I woke up in the vortex and I felt satisfied this morning I woke up in the vortex and I felt eager I love waking up in the vortex and feeling eager I like a feeling of eagerness I like a feeling of satisfaction today I looked at someone and I felt such appreciation for them I really enjoy feeling love when I'm in the vortex I feel satisfied I like being in the vortex because things feel clearer when I'm in the vortex I feel clear-minded I feel sort of elated when I'm in the vortex it's like my heart is singing when I'm in the vortex I feel satisfied when I'm in the vortex I feel ease when I'm in the vortex I feel sort of energized when I'm in the vortex I feel like doing stuff when I'm in the vortex my body feels good when I'm in the vortex I like taking a walk when I'm in a vortex my dog licks my face when I'm in the when I'm in the vortex I just feel I feel good when I'm in the vortex food tastes good I like being in the vortex when I'm in the vortex I know my power when I'm in the vortex I feel more sure about things when I'm in the vortex I know my own goodness when I'm in the vortex I, I just feel good about me when I'm in the vortex I trust that things are gonna go well when I'm in the vortex I feel optimistic about things when I'm in the vortex I feel ready for more when I'm in the vortex I feel like I can do about anything when I'm in the vortex I feel more sure of myself when I'm in the vortex I let people off the hook more when I'm in the vortex good things happen to me when I'm in the vortex I can feel I'm in the flow when I'm in the vortex I feel ease about life when I'm in the vortex it's like the universe cooperates with me when I'm in the vortex I know my goodness because it sort of surrounds me when I'm in the vortex the universe gives me evidence that I'm in there not as a reward but as a consequence of my alignment with who I am when I'm in the vortex the indicators that surround me in conversations and in my own emotions and in outright manifestations they represent my being in the vortex when I'm in the vortex I like being in the vortex when I'm in the vortex it seems easy to stay there when I'm in the vortex I want never to leave when I'm in the vortex it feels natural and normal to contemplate creation when I'm in the vortex I feel unlimited when I'm in the vortex I'm glad for all I've lived and what I've put in the vortex when I'm in the vortex I have clear view of what I've put here when I'm in the vortex I feel satisfied about my life when I'm in the vortex I feel ready to go and do more when I'm in the vortex I love my life when I'm in the vortex I love me when I'm in the vortex I love the people who help me put stuff in the vortex when I'm in the vortex I do better financially when I'm in the vortex I leverage time and effort in a better way when I'm in the vortex things line up for me better when I'm in the vortex it's like time slows down and satisfaction speeds up when I'm in the vortex I savor more when I'm in the vortex I sit and contemplate and my thoughts are pleasing to me when I'm in the vortex sometimes I just ponder just for the satisfaction of pondering that thought when I'm in the vortex it's like I only have access to the memories that are pleasing and to the current environment that is pleasing when I'm in the vortex I can feel that the whole of me is integrated with the source that is me and I know my power and my well-being and I sort of want to shout it from the rooftops I want to say bring it on world because I can handle it I want to say whatever it is I'm up for it I want to say I signed on for sifting through contrast and I'm good at it I want to say I know how to direct my thought I've trained myself there I'm really good at what I do I'm a powerful focuser I have been for a long time I love to focus upon good feeling thoughts I love to focus myself into alignment I love being in the vortex I love who I am I love this experience of creation I love the source energy part of me and lining up with it I love the fact that I was willing to depart from source a bit to stir things up I love how much I stirred up I love how much I put there I love the power of my desire I think it's my time Abraham I think it's time I think I've paid the price of contrast and I think I've put plenty there 
And I think I'm willing to let go of the resistant aspects of my life experience. I think I'm ready to just start trusting, to start trusting the laws of the universe and really putting this vortex thing to a test. I'm going to stop struggling and striving and I'm going to let my undivided attention go toward whatever it takes for me to get into the vortex. I love you, Abraham, and what you represent. I love the clarity that you have brought to me and the understanding that I have garnered for myself. I'm appreciative of all of the people who have sort of prodded me into expansion. And I am eager to come into full and constant alignment with that expansion. I acknowledge, Abraham, that I've spent time outside the vortex. And I'm happy that you remind me that everybody does. I acknowledge, Abraham, that I know the difference between alignment and not. You have given me many processes that have helped me know. And I have found myself feeling relief on occasion, but not really very often. I've been more in the vortex in this last five minutes that you've been rampaging to me once I finally stopped struggling and allowed you to have your way with me. I've been longer in the vortex just now than I have been for a very long time. And I'm beginning to feel the soothing of being in that vortex. I am beginning to understand the love that you have for me and the love that Source has for me. And I'm beginning to get that taste in my mouth of victory in terms of the things that I've been asking for. I want to announce to everyone listening to the entire universe who is vibrationally out there somewhere picking up on pieces of this in some way. I want to announce to everything and everyone who exists that I here now proclaim my determination to release my resistance once and for all. I give up. I give up. I give up. I give up. I give up my control of the uncontrollable. I give up my determination to make things better for others. I give up my attention to things that bother me. I give up my trying so hard. I give up my struggle. I give up my confounding confusion. I give up my excuse for negative emotion. I'm giving up my excuses. I'm giving up my statements of what is not working. I'm giving up. I'm yielding Abraham. I'm yielding to the truths and to the laws that you've been speaking to me. What I've been doing has been halfway, even though I've been wanting to do it all the way. I've given it more effort than anybody that you know in all of the people that you've been teaching. I've given it more effort. And in my struggle from outside the vortex, I have not managed what I want. And so now I see the light a little bit, Abraham. I see why you began depicting a vortex as a vivid reality with a line that I could cross. I'm beginning to understand that your request for me to get into the vortex is the only thing that will ever work for me. I have to let go of all of those pieces because in my interaction with all of those pieces, I just hold myself out and hold myself out and hold myself out. And my frustration is huge when I hold myself out as I'm trying to explain, but I'm only out because of this this reality and this reality and this reality Abraham I now understand that you were never trying to say to me that those realities didn't exist you were only trying to say to me that those realities do not serve me when I focus upon them you've convinced me Abraham that it's time for me to tell the story of my empowerment it's time for me to tell the story of my worthiness it's time for me to tout the benefit of my knowledge of law of attraction it's time for me to understand the vortex whatever in the hell it is and get into it it's time for me to begin finding my way, to begin feeling my way. I'm going to feel my way into the vortex and I'm going to stop thinking my way into the vortex. I'm going to feel my way in. It feels good here. It feels like clarity. It feels like power. It feels like love. It feels like solution. It feels like answers to questions. It feels like something that I've been looking for for a very long time. Abraham, clearly you're in the vortex. You have demonstrated that you're in the vortex. Your words reflect that you're in the vortex. I will not admit that I am in the vortex, but I like the sound of the way you sounded from inside the vortex. And it will be my eternal quest to give up whatever I have to give up in order to spend more of my time in the vortex. It's my time. It's my time to reap the benefit of the work I've done. And now I'm going to turn my undivided attention toward getting into the vortex as best I can.